community should have a say in how and where they operate. It is certainly not our goal or our objective to stop any homeowner who's interested in renting out their home or a room, but we just wanna make sure that they have to abide by the same rules. The short-term rentals do not pay the assessments that the hotels pay that drive tourism into the state. However, they do benefit from the tourism that the assessments are used to promote for the state. The health and safety of our guests is a primary concern. The short-term rentals do not have to abide by the same safety regulations that are imposed upon the hotels. 15 students were staying here as an Airbnb and only five of them were out when officers first got here. The 10 others were still trapped in the home and Lansing police tell me they actually had to run in but were able to get everyone out safely. And when you check into a short-term rental, you have no idea of how safe that experience might be. Firefighters tell me they couldn't see any flames coming out of the house when they first got here, but within five minutes it turned into this. I oppose the legislation because I think it's bad for Michigan tourism and the communities throughout the state.